Growing sunflowers in your garden is truly a rewarding experience. I would recommend any first time gardener to give growing sunflowers a try. Sunflowers are an easy grow, they are really low maintenance, and they are fuss free. They attract beneficial insects and are beautiful, stunning, striking flowers with their huge blooms. Sunflowers make excellent cut flowers, so if you're interested in starting a cut flower garden, I would definitely say give growing sunflowers a try. The closer you grow your sunflowers, the smaller your blooms will be, and the more you space them apart, the bigger the bloom will be. I lamented my soil and I have a well-tilled area for my sunflowers to be planted in, and within days, my little sunflower seedlings have emerged from the ground. So once your little seedlings have emerged, make sure you give them water. They love sun. They're called sunflowers for a reason. It's important when your seedlings emerge that you protect your seedling stems from cutworms. And you will also find that sometimes you will have different pests that will bother your sunflowers. So you can remedy this by using an organic neem oil solution and hand picking the pests from your flowers and disposing them in soap be water and you can keep your sunflowers bug and pest free by making sure that you have beneficial insects in your garden and your garden and your sunflowers will grow beautifully so make sure you plant them in a sunny spot and within a few months you will have beautiful stunning flowers in your garden to enjoy for the duration of the summer into the fall thought I would like sunflowers until I grew them myself from seed and into my garden and now I want all types of sunflowers and sunflowers come in many colors so if yellow is not your color of choice they come in deep wines and burgundies and reds and oranges there are so many beautiful sunflowers to choose from you can never get bored of them You can add additional visual interest in your garden if you have a cut flower garden area or if you want to make them as a backdrop and plant shorter flowers in front. Sunflowers will actually do the trick for this. I have corn and zinnias and sunflowers planted together and they did excellent together. Your flower heads on sunflowers make an excellent snack for birds and an excellent snack for you. After your sunflower heads have fully developed and dried, you can harvest their seeds and you can eat them as snacks from your garden.
So go out there and grow you some sunflowers. There's a really inexpensive. You can find sunflower seed packets as cheap as 20 cent to a dollar and you will have beautiful sunflowers within months. So go out and plant you some sunflowers for this season and enjoy their beautiful blooms. They will definitely put a smile on your face every time you see them. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you like it and I hope you do. Subscribe if you're new and I will see you on the next video. Bye.